Dollar Tree is the place to be. What's the name of this shopping center? I just know we in Pennsylvania. The tree, the Dollar Tree. Let's see how big this one is. It could go far back. All right. Well, at least that line ain't for the Dollar Tree. We don't know that yet. line is for fine wine and good fine spirits. Wine and liquors, right? Yeah, look. And spirits. <laughs> At least that's not the Dollar Tree line. That could be us waiting. We're gonna walk right in the Dollar Tree. Just walked in the DT and it goes pretty far back. It's a nice size Dollar Tree. Hi everyone, I'm Miss Black Gold and thank you for coming back to my channel. Or if you're new here, I appreciate you stopping through. I have a Harrisburg, Pennsylvania Dollar Tree haul for you. I really enjoyed driving out there today. Um, it was a beautiful drive. When I woke up this morning and saw how bright and sunny it was, I just knew I could not be in this house today. We've had rain throughout this week. And it was just like, it, I don't know, that sun just started me off with some great endorphins this morning. I was in a good mood. I was like, I'm getting out of here today. A buddy of mine called, wanted to go to the Sam's Club in Harrisburg. And I was like, sure, let's do it. Let's take the drive. It's about an hour and a half drive, if that. Um, so we hit the road, stopped at the Amish market on the way back, stopped at the Dollar Tree on the way back. We tried to go to a thrift store, but they're still closed. Um, and because that would have been perfect, too. I've got my list for the thrift store. When they open back up, things I need, I need to look for a nice big pot. I'm going to look for cast iron pots. I would like to look for, um, oh gosh, what else was on my list? A rolling pin. Um, so I've got some stuff on my list for the thrift stores, but I also uh, had a wish list for the Dollar Tree and I found some of those things. Like this was on my wish list. This Arizona tea. Um, it is their sun brewed style iced tea with lemon flavor. 59 fluid ounces, I found this. Um, they also had green tea, so I left that in my car. I have to send the boys down later to make sure they grab the green tea. And they also grabbed the Old Orchard um, Peach, the iced tea with peach. They had that too. Now, the Arizona says it's 59 fluid ounces. I'm not sure if the Old Orchard is could be 64 ounces, but at the least, it's 59 too because it's the big size Old Orchard. I picked up a box of this Kraft macaroni and cheese. Um, it being such a lovely day, I'm like, I'm taking it easy today. I've been cooking all week long. I don't feel like really cooking a lot tonight. It's going to be things that are quick and easy, like this Kraft mac and cheese. This is their original flavor. And this is a 7.25 ounce container. And I know there has to be a best if used by date on this. Because usually it is. Best when used by December 29th, 2020. And all the kids love this Kraft mac and cheese. And they love some baked macaroni and cheese. But for whatever reason, they still love themselves some box mac and cheese. I also grabbed Martinelli's Gold Medal Rosé Sparkling 100% Juice 10 Fluid Ounces. Picked up four of those. I haven't tried this yet. I should have got a consensus from the boys because... When they helped me, um, when I got to the door with the bags I had, this was in it, and the three of the the three of these are already gone. Um, I see that this says from the Stemmelt Orchards of the Northwest, so it is an apple, but it also has raspberry concentrates. So I guess that's what gives it the rosé. So you know the orbs we've been getting, the bigger size orb with the squish the squishy things um, in the toy section. This is by Orb 2. It's Orb Oddities. This is their squeezable keychains. I thought the unicorn was cute. They had a rhino, an elephant, and it's something else. Um, but so this is what happens. Out of the rear of the unicorn comes a glitter ball. I just I thought it was cute, especially for just having it on my keychain. And let's hope it makes it to my keys because more than likely the youngest Chandler will probably try to get this. This says it fits Apple Watches, the Apple Smartwatch. And this is their screen guard. This is a tempered glass screen guard. 
and 42 millimeters. I was gonna say milliliters, no, millimeters. Um, it also, they also had in the store 38, 40, and 42. I didn't see any other size, but I think because I did see, along with the screen guards, they also have smartwatch cases. They have the case that fits just the face, as well as Dollar Tree has the smartwatch case that has the straps to it. So they had two types of cases in there. And I believe in this, uh, the one that was just the face of the case, they had 44 milli millimeters. I know my brother has a 42 millimeter, so that's why I bought this one. I needed another spray bottle. Uh, the last spray bottle I had from the Dollar Tree, this part broke. So I needed this. I usually just put like rose water and vitamin E hair grade oil in these to spray on my hair. And I need one of these for that. I picked it up in green. So can you believe it? These multi-purpose bandanas. I remember when these were out like a couple of years ago. And as you see, you have all the different ways you can use these multi-purpose bandanas. Well, these are back. The Dollar Tree knew if there was anything right now with this pandemic going on, they better bring these back because you can use them just like a face mask. See that there? Um, this is the camouflage one. I only saw two designs when I was there. This black and white camouflage one. And when I had these years ago, I had like all seven to nine designs they had. And I gave them all the way to the thrift store. I wasn't using them. And I was like, if I'm not using them, maybe somebody else will. I wish I would have had them now, right? Who would have thought the pandemic would have come and you'd be using these? And then I also picked up this design. And this has a little like brown in it, if you can see the leaf. So these were the two designs they had and I picked those up. I also grabbed some floral garden, um, gross, gross grain, excuse me, gross grain with metallic striped ribbon. It comes in three yards. And this is black ribbon with that gold going down around the middle. And the reason I bought this, let me, I left the actual one I want to use, the face mask I want to use that ribbon with, I left in my car. But um, there's a lady in my neighborhood who makes these face masks, and she makes them that you could put the ribbon through. So when you put this on, you literally just tie it. And I really like this type um, because around my ears, those face masks have been hurting and tearing up my ears. I don't have a lot of cartilage up here. And that is where it hurts. Um, but I love these that tie on my head. And this, this is just ribbon. You can use a ribbon, a shoestring, anything you want to put in there and put this face mask on. And the face mask I left in the car is black and white. And I wanted to use this black ribbon for that. This was my first time ever seeing Pen Allen Original in their pine scent. This is a 25.3 fluid ounce. This is a multi-purpose cleaner Pen Allen. Love this. I usually get the floral scent, and I think the floral scent is a little bit bigger. Um, it's more than 25. It might be like 32 ounces or something. It's more, 28, something like that. Um, but I picked this up. I've never seen this pine scent before. And be careful with this, guys. When my son brought this in for me, and he called himself taking stuff out of the bag, he ran and put this in the refrigerator, my youngest, Chandler. I was like, Chandler, where is the Pen Allen? In the refrigerator? Baby, that is not ginger ale. I had to tell him this is not ginger ale. This is a multi-purpose cleaner. I said, reading is fun some fundamental, honey. You got to read. <laughs> he just assumed this was a big ginger ale. Uh, these are plant labels by Garden Collection 10-piece. And I've had these before. I don't know if I gave these to someone. But I actually planted some mint this morning, potted it, put it in a pot. I was able to grab some mint from a friend's front yard. It was growing wild, and she didn't even know she had mint. Um, but I was able to plant that mint, and I want to put a label in the pot so my boys know that it's mint. So if I need to send them to go grab a couple leaves, they'll easily know it's mint. And this is 10 pieces that you get in here. You can just write on this with a dry erase marker so it wipes off. Or use a permanent marker if you feel like you're always going to use that same label for that same thing. Here goes some decor. Now, this is just a white ceramic block. But it has the saying, keep life simple. And I just, 
I thought that was nice, sweet, and to the point, and it's something that I agree with. Keep life simple. They also had one that said, let it go. I can't remember what the others said. I grabbed this six pack of scrub buddies. Um, these are nail guard sponges. It says they're hand shaped, protects nails, multi-purpose and durable. Um, I could not remember how well these scrub buddy sponges work, but nevertheless, six of them for a dollar is not bad. Even if you use one every time you clean something and have to throw it away for a dollar, that's not a bad deal. This wall art by Special Moments. Um, this says, don't just count your blessings, share them. It does have this on the back for you to hang it, but how cute with the lemons. I'm hoping that I'm, I'm going to be able to put this in my eat-in kitchen somewhere. I just and, and again, another saying that I truly believe in, you got to have an open hand to give and to receive. So don't just count your blessings, share them. If you're blessed enough to be blessed and you have a little leftover, share it with somebody else. These are by Essentials. They are 100 count disposable gloves. One size fits all. Looking at the gloves, they actually look pretty big. And I bought these for my son. Now they say that these are ideal for while you're cleaning dishes, kitchens, bathrooms. And my son will clean the bathroom, but he is not going to do it. My oldest without gloves. Um, so this right here is perfect for him. He has 50 uses out of these 100 disposable gloves. They're not the real, from which, what I see, they're not like they're the real sturdy gloves, but they should do the job for cleaning. And if I really would have thought about it, I should have got more of these, because this is not something I find in the Dollar Tree all the time. Tool Benchware, is that what it's called? Excuse me, Tool Bench Hardware had this sharpening stone. And I love sharpening my knives. Like I, a good knife just cuts easy. It's just wonderful to me. So I wanted to grab the sharpening stone. They do have instructions on the back where it tells you to make sure the sharpening stone is completely wet. So follow your instructions. But this is a six inch sharpening stone. And these are two cans of Sunny Sea Alaskan Pink Salmon Wild Caught. They are five ounce cans. Of course, great for Omega 3. But I just made some salmon cakes this past week. And when I saw this, I was like, yes, indeed. Let me grab these two cans of salmon um, so I can make some more salmon cakes. Oh, and the date on this says best by, best if used by February 21st. 2023 and Casablanca's greatest catch their premium mackerel filet and sunflower oil and then I also have their gourmet tuna filet skipjack and water they both are 4.4 ounces let me show you that these um, do come in a can so for you to pop but the premium mackerel has a date on the back of November 11th, 2022. And then the skipjack and water has a date on the back of November 13th, 2021. And that was those two. And guys, that is all for my Dollar Tree haul from Harrisburg. But I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I just had a, a lovely day. And, and I pray you all are having good weather as well. Um, or you've had it. If, if you're not having it today, you've had it. But um, I'm going to go ahead and get me some rest. That is what I thought I was doing today. And that sun made me say, no, you got to get out there. But now for the rest of the day, I think I'm going to rest. I'm going to enjoy this glass of tea I have. I put some fresh mint in. And um, I'm, I'm chilling out for the rest of the day. So you all make it a great day on purpose. Make it an awesome weekend on purpose. And we will talk soon. Take care, everybody. Mm -hmm.